All right, it's three o'clock on Monday, and you've made it to the Tudor station. At three o'clock on Mondays, we talk about English. I love the energy. Look at you go. Dustin, if you can hear me. I can't see you, buddy. Your camera's off. At the Tudor station, we're a team. We're here to be supportive, respectful to each other. And we're here to practice our English. Dustin, I'm still not seeing you. Come join us, buddy. I logged is tuned in and ready to go. I like that. Let's all get tuned in and ready to go like a lanka. It is indeed 3 o'clock on Monday, so it is time to talk about some English. Today we better talk about some irregular words. Ooh, it's time to pull up a fresh story. Yeah, and let's see, we'll have Marceline kick us off. Alright, so Marceline, won't you start us off? And, uh, let's be respectful and not scribble on the board. Marceline, take us away. Let's see who's tuned in. Stick your hand in the air if you are here to learn. Marceline, are you ready to learn? Let me see that hand in the air if you can hear me. Alright, make sure to check your volume. Are you plugged in? What are you looking at? Are you looking at my window? Can you see me now? Marceline, I'm not hearing you. Can you hear me now? Let's be respectful and stick to our own blocks as we write words with the ow sound. Write the word clown. Marceline, it's your time to shine. Here's a story for you to read. Take your time to read it clearly. We'll see how far you can get in one minute. Marceline, you're going to start at the top here. Are you ready to go? Yes. Try your best in three, two, one, and go. Start now? Yes, start now. Where do I start? Your regular words are cool words, but sometimes they can be a little tricky. They don't sound quite like they're spelled. Dustin, you look like you're itching for something to do. Why don't you give me a hand and tell me what this word is? Which words? This one right here, I got my fingers all over it. Then? Excellent. On the nose, Dustin. Now tell us what you've been up to and stick that word in sentence. Oh, Alan. I've been up to the roof. We're going to pull up a story and read this story to you. As we go through, we want you to underline all the words with the I-N-G suffix. Right? Be respectful and note scribble on the screen so we can get through the whole story. All right, let's go. How about this one? That one confuses me too. Next. Hello, it's good to see you too. Get ready to go. No, don't find me. Finna. I like the consistency. All together now. Like a metronome. Mmm, the hard one. Can you hear me now? Hi, right, Dustin. This one's for you. Show us what you got. Is that a mic drop or performance anxiety? You're going to read as far as you can for one minute. You start at the top. Ilaka, are you ready? I'm ready. Ilaka, do your best in three, 
two, one, go. You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy. Our next challenge is all about the long O sound. Like long O can be tricky. There are lots of ways it can appear. Today's challenge word, you tell me how to spell it. They will all have the long O sound. If I say G W. All right, it's your turn to try. Ivy, spell the word nose for Are you there? This usually works better with the mic on, eh? All right, I'll try it again. Our next challenge is all about the long O sound. Like in go or snow. I'm going to pull the board up so you can scribble for one minute. You got one minute to get all the scribbles out. All right, here it comes. Here comes the board. Three, two, one, and scribble. Um, can we read instead? <laughs>